Buddy, what are you doing here? You're not supposed to be here. You know what? Get out. Get out and never come back, you freak, you big fat doofus. Sorry, everybody. That was a big mistake. Anyways, let's go back to the stage. Anyways, let's introduce the contestants. So the contestants are a $2 bill, Thomas's twin brother, Tidward, and Charlie. He was surprisingly dumb for no reason. Anyways, today is a very special episode because... All the contestants were randomly chosen from the Wheel of Names dot com. Anyways, let's start with an easy and warm up question. What is one times one? Let's see if you fellow contestants can answer this one. Is the answer one because it's the same as two minus one? Wow, finally we have a genius in the show. Yes, Tidward, that is the correct answer. You get 100 points. Oh, and by the way, the reason why I didn't add any music or sound effects was because budget cut, so one of the contestants will we have to use to pay for the next episode. So yeah, anyways, next question. Who won the American Civil War? Was it the Union or the Confederacy? Is the answer Justin from Justin and Friends? Charlie, that's a TV show, and that's not even a team. No, Justin from Justin and Friends. Wait a minute. I'm from Justin and Friends. Woo-wee, I'm in two shows. Wow, that's actually pretty cool. Anyways, no, dumb Charlie, I'm not in the American Civil War. It was a two-answered question, dumb dumb. That's it. You get 40 negative points, and you have three weeks of work. Three weeks of work? But I have to watch Justin and Friends. Well, too bad, Charlie. You should have answered the Union or the Confederacy, dumb dumb Man, even the laziest one in the show. But the answer is still up for grabs. No $2 bill. That is not the correct answer. The Miami Dolphins. They don't even exist in this world. Or I think. I'm just made out of a paper with a stick controlled by a real life human. See? I'm just being voiced. Well, that's reasonable. But is the answer the American Civil... Well, not the American Civil War, but was it the Union? Corrected word. That is the correct answer. You get 300 points. And as for you, $2 bill... You only get 10 negative points. So you have 6 days of work. But it's just an object. It can't work. Plus, I don't even know how that thing was picked anyway. Just for talking back to me, Charlie. You're out of the Justin and Friends fan club. What? Please give me a second chance. I promise I won't talk back ever again. Well, 
There is no second chances unless if you pay six hundred and eighty two five thousand six hundred and eighty three million dollars for the platinum fan membership because if you do you get unlimited chances. Well, here's the money I'll pay for you later. Well, okay, you better do because if I don't see that money, you are doomed. But isn't the money right there? Oh yeah, that's a good point. Well, uh, so, sorry, two dollar bill, but I'm I'm taking you. All right, the it's paid in full. All right, now who's gonna be our new contestant? Oh man, this is gonna be rough. I need someone that can help this dum dum. Hmm, who should it be? Oh well, I guess I'll go to the back to see who will be the the first contestant. Man, I hope I get picked in the third episode. Me too, because if I do, I'll be the pride of the line. Hey guys, Justin's coming. Shut up. Hey guys. Oh, hi Justin. What's up? This is my first appearance on this spinoff. Yeah, I just have one thing to tell you. Since the two dollar bill, which was luckily to be picked. By the wheel of names, decided to be off of the show, and、uh, hmm, I was wondering if one of you engines and、uh, electric engines can be on the show. So, who's gonna be on the show? Because we really need a third contestant. Well, I want to go. Yeah, me too. On the. Pride of the line. I should be on the show. No, I should be on the show. Somebody kill me. Well, I think I should be on the show. No, I should be on the show. I mean, like, look at me. I have a fabulous paintwork. Hmm. Who should it be? Uh, let's see. Uh, Thomas or. Percy, I already went on to go, and uh, well,、uh, well, it is the end of the main series, and Thomas haven't had a job in weeks. So,、uh, alright, James, I guess you can go, but teach that stupid Charlie a lesson. I want you to push him when you come on the stage, so that way. You and Young Bao can go on the show together. Ah! Uh, tsk, uh, the camera. Oh man. Wait. So you're saying that I can go on the show? Yep. If you ah, stupid camera. If you want. Well, don't mind if I do. Ha ha, suckers. Well, I'm coming too. I've never been on a show before. Since Trackmaster Thomas and Friends, which recently ended for its first season, yeah, I guess you're right. All right, boys, let's go. Yay! Oh man, I hate my life. Me too, Thomas. Well, wo- well, welcome to the club, boys. Man, where's the host? He should be here by now. I know, right? Do 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 do. Alright, that's enough. Anyway, sorry about that, viewers and fellow contestants. Anyways, we have a new two contestants. Two contestants. I thought there's only three on this show. Yeah, that's a little weird. To despite the fact that, hey, what are you doing? <gasps> Now that's much better. Young Bao, wait, what are you doing here? I got picked as the new contestant, dum dum.
Man, what? I thought you were too smart to figure that out. Yeah, coming through. I'm the pride of the line. Thank you, thank you. Hey, what's going on? There can't be... That's cheating, young Bao. What am I, Dumbo? Am I dumb? Well, you are lazy, and you do watch Justin and Friends all day. You don't even go outside and play. I mean, look how fat your face is. What? My face is not fat. Do do do. Okay, I guess you're right. I'll join Thomas and his stupid friends. Good. Screw you, Charlie. You're my least, my least favorite person in Thomas and Friends. You, you stupid, you stupid doofus. Anyways, next question. What was Sega's last console? Wait, Charlie, what are you doing on the set? You're supposed to be with Thomas and his stupid friends. I heard that. Oh, shut up, Thomas. Okay, Charlie, you're supposed to be with Thomas and his gang and stuff. No one tells Charlie what to do. I want to be the fourth player in the show. Ta Charlie, that's against the rules. Only three players are allowed. If you don't let me be a fourth contestant, I'm going to sue your monkey behind for two million dollars. No, no matter how hard you try to sue me, I will still refuse. Hey, Charlie, what are you doing? I'm taking this $2 bill because you don't deserve it. Wait, Charlie, what are you doing? That's my last bit of my life savings. Oh, yeah? You think you can hide from me? Well, I just found your wallet. Wait, you mean my, my real-life counterpart wallet? Yep, and I'm going to show all the viewers your private stuff. Wait, don't! Alright, viewers, I got this wallet. Now let's go see what's inside. I bet there's going to be lost and stolen credit cards here. Alright, let me go dig it out. Okay, so, um... Ch Charlie, don't you dare! I swear in the name of Puppy Jesus, if you do this, I am gonna call the police! Well, here goes nothing! Time to pull it out so the R IRS can see the numbers! Charlie, please, don't, please! I don't want the IRS to find out I have... Dun, 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 dun. On oh, my credit card, please don't! Okay, here are the numbers. So the numbers are... Beep! And the expiration date is... Now I told the numbers to the YouTube community. Now the IRS is going to find out. Charlie, what did you just do? I took out your credit card and showed it to the contestants. No, not only that, that was credit card theft, you idiot. But good thing I edited this out and censored all the stuff on my credit card. Wait, you did what? How's the IRS is gonna find out? Well, nobody will upload a censored, well, uncensored version of it on YouTube. So, I'm a cop. Wait, you a cop? Yep, and I never told you that, Charlie. So you're under arrest for credit card theft and blurting all the numbers out to these fellow contestants. Uh, I didn't hear anything. I was watching and recording this and putting earplugs on. Yeah, me too. Me three.
Uh oh, got a blast, cuz BOOM! No, you get back here right now! Well, sorry, viewers. It looks like we have to end this episode. It wasn't my fault. Charlie was trying to do credit card theft in front of you guys. So, it looks like we'll just lend our final question in. So, the, the final question is, what was Sega's last console before they became a third party developer? Is the answer to Sega Dreamcast? No, I was gonna say that. You always say that. Why, you little? Wait, what, 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 wait, you know what, you're weird. Oh, yeah, stop it, stop it, daddy. Will you shut up? <sighs> James, that was so cool. He's a nerd. Yeah, I know, right? Anyways, the answer is Sega Dreamcast. But then, in 2019, Sega released, in partnership with App Games, numerous Sega Genesis consoles and handhelds. And then, in 2019, they released the Sega Genesis Classic. So, the, the Sega Genesis models are still continuing to this very day. Well, I guess that's true, James. You get 40 points. Anyways, viewers, that's the end of the episode. Episode 3 will come out sometime in August, but, well, this month. Anyways, see you guys later. Bye! Oh, and by the way, kids, the moral of the story is, don't show... Your credit card in public to other strangers unless it, they're family members. And if you find, steal someone's credit card or gift card or debit card, that's credit card flawed and you can go to jail. The end. Oh, and you will be sued for how much you, uh, did on your, your parents or somebody else's credit or gift card. So, yeah. Bye.